Okay. <clears throat> this is the third video. We're gonna try and make it around 15 minutes. Because the last one was about half an hour just above. It took so many hours to render. Oh, it's painful for me. So, it took maybe two and a half, three hours to render a foot. And like, it's sad because I thought I fixed up all my, um, all my settings. Like, my raw recordings, the quality of the video was good. Uh, it's, it's indistinguishable, but once it gets in the video editor and I render it, everything is like all compressed and... I'm trying to figure it out, but I think that's just the way videos are. Or it could just be the software that I'm using, which I'm learning now is probably not the best. So the videos come out compressed and weird to my eye. And then YouTube, just uploading on YouTube, compresses it further. The video quality, the visual quality of my videos aren't that good. And it's like, it doesn't feel good, man. It's not the best, but I feel like it's good enough. Anyway. This is the third video. We're gonna make it short-ish. I already took up a lot of time just explaining this, my little situation. Bark and Shiem, Bark and Shiem Creek discovered. So we're supposed to find someone here. Let's go down. When does one look like it? Well, it's too late now. So I cut this down. Oh, wow, wow, there we go. Get that wood. Eat wood. So the job description, right, is that we bring spirits to we help spirits move on, right? I guess all we're doing right now is... Is you? Hey. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Great! You're here! Oh! Listen. I dropped a lemon in the pond. My fingers were all sticky. It's just sort of slipped. Why? Good question. I've been eating delicious berries all day. Look at my hands, I swear. I've been experimenting. I wanted to squeeze a little bit out of the citrus on these wild fruit. Now it's just berries with no twist. Unless it's just down there in the water. I do it myself. <laughs> I can't keep it up. I'll do it myself, but I have this pup, pupply, pulpy, oh, this pulpy fruits to take care of. Well, let's get your fruits, boy. A lemon. That's your lemon, son. I just need to find a tissue or something. I don't want to get bear juice all over it. Never mind. Just hold on to that lemon for me. Don't go and squeeze it. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help me. This island is fresh out of food. My stomach always feels empty. Maybe I could even help out aboard your ship. With cooking, fishing, and building. I don't have my spies. I don't know. I don't have my spices or tools, but I'll make it work. Don't think about it so much. Let's just go to your boat. Oh boy. This guy. Oh. <laughs> maybe I could. Maybe I should read all their voices with the sound that like. Oh. I love them. All right, let's go back to the boat. Oh shit! I'll be your new favorite passenger. Just your wait. So was he like a frog spirit? Is that what I was seeing? Stella. Oh. Oh wow, this boat is amazing. Here comes the real kicker, you little rascal. Get ready for my family reunion. Wonderful. Jeez. Wow. Nice. It's me, Stella. Your uncle, a, a, a tool. Tool. Happily, I hope. Aw. Been on this island for a while now. I can't wait to see the sights, the seas with you. 
I was lonely without with my thoughts. Now I got you, Sprout. Let's set sail the great adventure. Oh, wait, wait a second. Is that... What? A what? I want to see what he's so excited about. The fishing? I knew it. That's a Seamaster 2000. I've actually never seen one in action. I've only heard the rumors. Apparently, you can catch the biggest and brightest fish out there. Wow, Stella, you sure know how to treat yourself. Wait a darn second, you're missing a few bolts. Let me guess, you've been fishing out mostly garbage. Well, not anymore. You'll see the difference immediately. Give it a go. Wait, did he see fam? Shit, I'm gonna have to look back at the editor. So, will you improve the fishing? Get over here. A squid. Yes. What's he doing over there? Stick his tongue out the corner of the screen, man. Fancy face. Do one more and then we'll see what's up with um, a tool or a tool. Wow, this is a. There we go. Soul. Great job, Sprout. They never stood a chance. Sure don't mess around. All this ace level fishing has gotten me all rattled up. Which reminds me, I had the shiny thing in my pockets on the island. I have no idea what it does. Maybe you can look into it. For safekeeping, I suppose. Oh, brother, I need to take a breather. Oh, and by the way, you might be curious. I might have not already tried, but yes, the water is very salty. We'll still take a good look and take a look. Blah, 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 blah. You can fish to your heart's content if you want. Hey, I got that able. We're gonna go back to Hummingburg. Cool, because I want to use that shrine thing. Too dark to navigate. Okay. Oh, wow. It looks tasty, hey? Gonna take a while. Oh, yeah. Look how far we can zoom out, by the way. Does that mean this ship is going to take up most of the screen one day? This game may have been bigger than I thought it was. Where's Hummingbird again? Oh, what do you know? Yeah, that's how I sleep too. Oh yeah. Oh no, I didn't mean to, but okay. Whee. Is this ready? Ooh. What is important, right? Water. Oh, I don't have to do them individually? I just push it once. Seems to be a storm. Oh, quick, come here. This is what I call a storm. Any respectable person would never let their friend get hit by lightning. But I think you should try. <laughs> you have the Everlight, it will protect you. The lightning bolts will cast sparkles where they are about to hit. Rush towards those. I almost forgot. Have you got any imp- Oh, if you're hit by lightning with an imp- you're lightning on a bottle. Isn't that bananas? This world. Lightning is in bottles is pretty handy, reassurance. Oh my god. They're pretty easy to come by. Get ready for the thrill of your life. So, now I know where I get- Oh, can I get my food? Okay. Lightning time, I got it. Woo! Woo! Do I have another one? Woo! Do I just keep getting them or what? Oh! Here we this is cool. How many bottles do I have? Oh, snap! Okay, I don't 
don't think I have any more bottles. I'm just getting glims now. Which is neat. Music stopped. I think that's it. Okay. I wasn't sure if you were going to make it for a second there. It gave you your old uncle quite a scare. Did you feel that rumble? What a rush. It looked pretty awesome catching lightning jolts. Lightning... Catching those lightning jolts all over the boat. Thanks for being the best captain I could ever have hoped for. So, do I really have that many lightning in the bottles? Wow, 12. Wow. Oh, can the food burn? Squid skewer. All right, we're in a garden. I don't know why I keep going up. We are. Wow. Do I have any, um... Oh, well, I do. Carrot. Turnip. Just double down on the turnips, huh? Nice. Did you look at that? You got two ovals. Yes, I remember that shrine. I will. If we're lucky, it might do something amazing. If not, you'll have wasted your time. <laughs> you should go see. I will. I gotta water my... Ooh. Wait, no. These aren't harvestable yet. I don't... I'm still not sure if I have to water them individually, or I can just push X anywhere and it'll work. Anyway, let's go check the town. Stinky spirits all over the place. Let's get it. Acquire. I like the statue. Oh, it's like little spirit people, I think. Oh, shit. Ooh. My god. So dramatic. I don't remember what she said that does. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's what I was saying earlier! That's all I needed! That's all I wanted was a double jump! Yes! Okay, wait. Where's that nerd that was like, you'll never get up here. What's up, nerd? You made it. Wicked moves getting up here. I kind of lied earlier. Not so great up here. But you're here, so it might get better. I don't have a membership card for you. You'll be an honorary member of this upstairs crew. I'd show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. <laughs> oh, I can just sit here? Here we go. See? Okay. Locked. Okay, what about you? Me too, man. Mm, nice. Can I steal your seeds? <gasps> Those are outside. Okay. Whoop, whoop. You look contemplative. What? Oh. You gave me such a grief. No, 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 no. That cat. He looks familiar. Daffodil. <laughs> is that you? Ah, oh, yes, yes, it is. Ever so silky, aren't you? Then you must mean. Stella, is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events. And. Is that your boat over there at the sea? You've come to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time, I'll be on... I'll be the one doing teaching. You can bet on it. Let's get going, then. We have some lessons to go through. Wait. Ooh. Another spirit. It looked like some kind of... Maybe a snake? Whee. It was wonderful. There's crew. So if we go to other islands, are there going to be other upgrades? Because I'd love to just fly around. <laughs> like in, um, what's another lovely game? game? That like turn-based Child of Light, was it? that's what it was called. 
Over here, look. I've already forgotten the voice. Something I was stood at is all this air. All this open space. Yes, I feel I can go quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm flowering already. Oh, they are a snake. <laughs> oh, getting out of this chrysalis. What a feeling. Thank you, Stan. Nice. Nice, we're all here. We got three spirits. Means we got three jobs, right? Do they talk to each other and have a good time? Oh, a garden? Okay. Look, little one, old silly me. Just as I was about to reprimand you for the lack of greenery on your boat, but lo and behold, you've already put together a wonderful little garden. Yes, I feel you've been excellent, students. Well then, that makes us just about ready to start the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in the plots when they're blah 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 blah. Ready to do. Your first lesson will start with something I'm quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules. Probably noticed already. I've always been a preacher for love towards all living beings. Well, you see, a garden is a vessel of our love, a mirror we hold ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Back in my island, when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. And as I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Though trial and error, through trial and error, I've managed to write a little song. The plants seem to react particularly well to it. I want to further test this observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing a piece. Plantasia Fantastica. Guitar. Hold Y to play guitar. Okay, I'm holding Y. Oh, wow. So I think I went a little too long there for video purposes, but I was kind of mesmerized by it for a little. Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entered? Uh, played it with the. I didn't read that. Isn't that fabulous? As I suspected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, I'd make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows? Other passengers might know how to play some music too. They might help if in a good enough mood. Speaking of which, in our commotion over the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. This strange coin has been tickling me. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna leave this not be one of those pollen allergies again. An Ubal. Ubal. Stella. Yes, Gwen. You did good. Now we've got a real boat going. And you'll have to take care of these two passengers now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But before all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed it by now, but the sleeping in the guest house is no ideal scenario for any of us. Yes, especially since it's getting crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. You've been terrific up to this point, and it would be terribly rude of me to blame you for anything. But I think it's time for me to have a space of my own. A nice little house. Unpretentious, but sophisticated. With a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind far from the turmoil of the deck. Mm. Hardly enough, I'd see something with an alpine flare. <coughs> see, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Again, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build that for me. Wen's Lodge. A Personal lounge garden. Does it matter? I kind of like it when it's attached to stuff. Uh, okay. Mm hmm. Good. This cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo in Waverly? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. 
I want to see. Oh, there's not much in here. I can't think about anything else but food right now. Oh, let's give her food. She likes comfort food, right? All right. Uh, fine dining. Spoiling this deer. That's a cake. Sweet. Stella, I didn't want to disturb you with this, but for the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams. They were of a giant snake. And of menacing reefs. And of rotten fruit. And since joining you and your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea, or maybe the mystical energies of the Everlight. Anyway, I'm now convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. Hmm? I've been looking on the map and it has been. My eyes kept being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. Whoa! <laughs> Can I make them all? Nice, uh... Cabins? I'm gonna catch one fish and the video's gonna end. Okay. Well, squid. <laughs>